Coach Alexander, how are you today? Doing well, Blair. It's great to be here in Titan territory, excited about the upcoming season. Speaking of the upcoming season, you have eight returning, eight new players on your roster. Talk to me a little bit about the chemistry of the team. I think our chemistry starts with our seniors. When you look at our roster, you have this division of, of veteran players versus newcomers. Um, it situates to a eight and eight split. And within that eight, when we start with the veterans, we know our seniors uh, that bring back experience, as well as some of our juniors and sophomores that bring back experience, to the likes of Chris Jenkins, who's a return starter and leading scorer for us, um, who's a guy that can play multiple positions, four to three to two, you know, and some would argue the one as well. Um, he's a kid that's not only battle-tested as a fifth-year senior, he's seen different levels of play, having played in the Big 12. Now he's in the Horizon League. He's going to do tremendous things for us. You look at guys like Jaleel Hogan, who has been a, a, a force inside, you know, throughout the league, you know, um, double-digit scoring as well. Uh, I think he's a player that's not only going to attract double teams, but he has the ability with his experiences to also make other teammates better. Then Josh McFally. I mean, here's a dynamite kid who had really great assist to turnover ratio numbers last year for us that can come in and play the point guard position, the off guard position. He's just a ball of energy that changes the dynamic of games. So when you look at those three returning starters, I think that's where things began. I'm excited about our young guys as well. And I think a lot of that starts with our core three guys. And we're 16 members strong, so that's something that's new to Titan territory, something that we're excited about, and we want everybody to just get out there and grow with us. One of the things we talked about in, in this year's theme with our 110th season in front of us is bringing the D back to Detroit. And we want to make sure that we understand that defense and rebounding is what wins championships. On the offensive side, here's a team that was fifth in the nation in scoring. So we don't want to throw that out either. We want to find that perfect sweet spot between executing, ball movement, player movement. We like to play through the paint in a variety of different ways. I think what one of the things that you want to do when you're trying to establish a program and get them to a championship level culture is you want to get the proper feedback based on the proper stimuli. So when you look at exhibition games like Wayne State and Ferris State, home openers against Adrian, playing in the preseason NIT, these are all programs that are not only going to bring a more than formidable um, approach to letting you know exactly where you are prior to conference play, but these are programs that we want to mimic in the future as we try to attain our own successes. And we feel that when you schedule tough like that, it not only prepares you for the rigors of a one-bid league like the Horizon League, but it also provides your young people with the stimuli to let them know how hard they must work each night in and out. It allows us to travel home and away and not lose our identity with regards to what venue we're in. And that would be the goal. You've heard it directly from head coach Bakari Alexander, depth, diversity, and defense. Make sure you tune in to DetroitTitans.com for all of your men's basketball coverage.